Hello, hello, ladies. Welcome, welcome. I'm so excited to talk to you today. And today we're talking about the rule of no kissing for three months. Actually, you can set this rule the way you want it. It doesn't have to be only no kissing. It can be just no sex for three months when you are starting to um, date and when you are starting to um, see somebody, okay? So whatever you decide for you, it's really flexible. Um, you decide whatever fits you best. I truly believe that it's a good rule to not kiss for a while first. Um, but basically this video is about setting boundaries and not being afraid of being ghosted because of that. Yeah, and not being afraid of being ghosted and why, why it is so important to set those boundaries. Why is it so important to um, stay away from intimacy in the beginning at least. Okay, so this video is especially for women that want to find their lifetime partner or that wants to find a, a long-term happy relationship. So when you are, you know, just wanting to have some fun and maybe something casual, um, it's a different story. Then you are available for something else, then this of course doesn't apply. However, if you're tired of casual um, things, <laughs> if you're tired of um, just one date and then never see the, seeing the guy again, or if you're tired of being um, physically and emotionally bonded to an unhealthy man who isn't a match for you and you're not, uh, you guys have not been a good match, then um, this video is being so life-saving to you because you will be able to filter the man without going through heartbreak, okay? But it takes a little bit of discipline, especially if you are uh, feeling attracted to the man. So I understand that. Okay, so let's get started. So um, imagine you say you have the rule of no kissing for three months, okay? And um, then you're on a date and the guy tries to kiss you. And then um, you're just gonna say it to him. You're like, oh, I appreciate in sandwich tool yeah so you know i'm not withholding with you any tips here like uh, i'm just wanting to give so much to you so you, you're just gonna use a sandwich tool you say oh i'm so flattered that you are interested in kissing me i am too however i have a personal boundary that i don't do that for the first three months or you can say another timeline, but make the decision at home, not on the date. <laughs> okay. And um, then what often happens is that fear comes up that this man is going to leave and ghost me if I say no to that. Or maybe your rule is no sex for three months or no sex until marriage. And then you're going to be afraid that, oh, he's not going to ghost. He's going to ghost me if I say that. So let me tell you one thing. It's easier, it's easier to set the rule of no kissing because then you didn't have any intimacy yet. And then if he goes to you, it's not gonna hurt. But when you're already, you know, are intimate a little bit with the guy, kissing, making out, whatever, and then you say any um, boundaries with, you know, you don't have sex until marriage or something, um, it's going to be a little bit more painful when the guy goes. So that's why I also recommend a no kissing boundary. Yeah. So, um, okay, let's continue. So imagine you say this to the guy and then he wants to um, ghost you. Okay, let's imagine he wants to do that. I want you to celebrate it because this man just wanted to have intimacy from you and nothing serious. A man that wants to spend 40 years with you 30 years, 40 years, he's going to wait. What are three months? He's going to value you as a person, as a human being. He's going to respect your boundary because your happiness is his priority. That's a healthy man who's treating you highly, okay? He's going to respect this boundary. And if he decided 
that yes, this woman has potential to be my wife, my forever wife, he's going to wait. And um, he's going to be secure that, okay, she needs time to see how great I am. I'm going to show her. I'm going to show her with my high effort treatment um, how great of a man I am. And she's going to trust me and she's going to see that um, um, it's safe and she'll be even more, more interested in me. Okay, so this is what a healthy man will respond. But a man who just cannot look past the three dates mark because he wanted to ghost you after three dates anyways, he's going to run. And you know what? You saved yourself so much time. You sa saved yourself a lot, a lot of time, okay? And also heartbreak because kissing already gets a woman very often already attached. Okay, so um, I hope this video inspired you. So what you take from this video is go and write on a piece of paper at home, not on a date, what do you want to set as a boundary. So be crystal clear on that. And then you just um, tell it to this guy that you are um, that you are having this boundary. And I also have done another video um, about telling the guy that you're also circular dating. So if you need to uh, watch that, um, then go ahead and search for this video in my group or on YouTube. Um, but these, those, these two things go together. So you're circular dating, but you also stay away from intimacy to really get to know a person, get to know the man, and um, may the best man win. And if a man is stable, secure, he's gonna know he will win and he will invest in you. And after he invested in you, he will not, go, he will not want to let go of you because a man falls in love when he invests in your time, energy and money. And um, so allow him to invest time in you to, um, go on walks, to go for coffee, to go for dinners. And um, the most interesting thing that actually took me personally a while to understand is that men even want this. They are tired of getting everything cheap and fast. It's like they want the most expensive car. They just want to pay for it. <laughs> they just want to work hard because it makes them feel like a winner. It makes them feel like they have won some, something special that not everybody can have. Not everybody can have um, the most expensive, um, nice car, right? So um, that's uh, something you can take as an example too. Like when you want to be this feminine woman who is surprised, he's going to want to work hard to win you over because when he does win you, um, he will be so proud at um, himself yeah so that's why if a man um, can get everything so fast and easy he's just not gonna value that it's human nature okay all right so i hope this video helped you and again if you are interested in one one of my in my one-on-one support then reach out to me for a free love assessment call and i'm going to be so excited to help you on your journey.